Hello, I was asked to find a way of simplifying linear expressions. So let's try a couple examples here. This simplify an expression asks us to take negative 2, multiply it against the quantity v plus 3, and then add 6v. So in the first case, we have a negative 2 multiplied by a quantity v plus 3. So in order to perform this, we want to use the distributive property. The distributive property, or the rainbow I sometimes call it, is to take the first number, multiply it against the first element, and take the beginning number and multiply it against the second element. So that would distribute the negative 2 through the addition that is happening in the parentheses, we would say. So since I put the initial entry in the binomial as a v let, and in blue, let me use the color blue to show what we would get in that first place. Negative 2 times v would be negative 2v. Then in the second place we have a negative 2 multiplied by 3 which is the quantity negative 6. Notice I kept the plus sign the same and distributed simply the negative 2 versus the v and the negative 2 versus the 3. Then tacked on to the end here we have a plus 6v. Now at this stage we have two terms that can be combined together. We have a negative 2v and we have a plus 6v. So in order to add those quantities together I'm going to take their coefficients negative 2 6 and when we take negative 2 plus 6 that's equal to the number 4. Let me put that in a little cloud to the side. So when I actually do that in this problem the negative 2 v plus the 6 v would come out to be a 4 v because of the coefficient or sorry because of the variable. Now we still have plus a minus 6 or plus a negative 6 so at the end of this we also need to put a minus 6 so that keeps this part right there and then the two underlined orange parts become the 4v. And this is considered to be fully simplified because the t terms are unlike. One has a v and one is just simply an integer. Okay, Let's try that one more time. Let's try to simplify the expression 5 times the quantity 4y plus 2 minus the number 12. And much like before, let me put in my little rainbow so I can see where I'm going to be distributing in. I'll use red for my first quantity this time. 5 multiplied by 4y would be 20y. Connector symbol, plus. And now in blue, 5 times 2 is the number 10. And then at the end, we just have this minus 12 hanging off. This time, our like terms would be the numbers 10 and minus 12, minus the number 12. No need to worry about a variable this time, like we did on the last one. Okay, 10 minus 12 would be the number minus 2, or more technically negative 2. So now we have the 20y at the beginning, which was untouched. 20y just gets carried on down to here. And then the positive 10 minus 12, or the plus 10 minus 12, becomes the quantity minus 2, which is lopped onto the end here. These, of course, cannot be simplified or combined either, because one has a variable and one does not.